guys and welcome back i'm andrea michelle and welcome 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 um so i'm just really chilling around the house i'm off work today i've been going through this whole like migraine and i had a cyst on my breast that is like too much tmi it is leaking okay let me tell you the story but before i tell you the story go ahead and subscribe to my channel and definitely hit that thumbs up and leave comments below okay so let's get back to that tmi too much too much information okay your girl is not looking her best today i just got my natural hair pulled to the back with my uh army hat on and a dress yeah an army hat and my dress y'all just love me for who i am because i love you guys oh let me let me tell you guys this before I get into the video, if no one has told you they love you today, I love you. I love you. We love you. Me and my son, we love you. I love you like a big sister. I love you like a little sister. I love you like a big cousin. I love you like a little cousin. I love you like a daughter. I love you like you're my grandma. I love you. I love you. I <laughs> love you. Um, so, yeah. Um, but let's get back to this cyst that I have on my breast. I was going to take a picture of it and show you guys what it looks like. But it's just, oh my gosh, it's just disgusting. Okay, so I was at my house yesterday and I was cleaning. And I have like a great sense of smell. Um, and I kept smelling something fishy. And I was like, I know. <laughs> Your girl, no. I know. I am totally decluttering everything. I'm cleaning up everything. Why does it smell like fish? Like totally smelling like fishy fish like seriously y'all and I just kept walking around and walking around my mom had told me earlier in the day she's like you have a bad infection and running through your your body and you need to go to the doctor like you really and I made an appointment for my doctor's appointment thank god you guys I found a doctor that I truly truly like okay um and I had an appointment for Monday um and she was gonna actually go in and cut cut it um to make all the yucky pussy stuff come out and I was just like I know I just kept and I you know I take my mom word to heart because I love my mom and anything she tell me is it's gonna happen or you need to be you know happening <laughs> so I, I just I called my doctor and I told her and she was like come in on Monday um I don't have any you know too many patients <laughs> and so I had a scheduled appointment for Monday and I'll be I'd be shocked okay I was shocked um and I kept like I said I kept smelling something fishy and I was like oh some stinks really bad so um I went into my son's area because sometimes you know kids can put food and stuff in their toys and stuff so I'm I'm lights on everything down all his toys and stuff like that and I said well that's not smell I keep smelling it so I was like well let me go check the trash um and so I had a little bit of trash, but it wasn't food in the trash can, so it wasn't my trash can. It wasn't. <laughs> hi! Uh, want to say hi to people? Hi. Don't squeeze me too hard, boo. Um, but yeah, you want your snack? Mm -hmm. So I, I made Ashton a little snack today. I gave him some grapes and apples in his Ziploc bag, and then he's pouring his own water. Are you going to drink all that? Just do a little bit so you can have some for later, okay? Okay. Um, there's Lindsay. There's my mommy. I love her like crazy. Lindsay's a Taurus, so. Y'all know, y'all know. That's a Taurus for you. <laughs> so, um, anyways, let me put this back in the fridge. What are you doing, my water? That's your water? Yes. Told you she's a Taurus. Don't mess with her stuff. She a bull. She said, I'm a bull. Okay. Uh, but that's my mama. Uh, y'all already know Lindsay. Don't act like y'all didn't know. But yeah, I've been suffering from this cyst. I mean, like, it had, like, had me, like, just, my energy level was just down. Like, it was really down. It was just bad. So, um, I, like I said, I was at the house and. I kept smelling some, some fishy fishy, so I took out the trash and everything like that, and I kept saying, some don't smell right, so I went in the couches, and girl, nothing's going to be in my couch, because I clean my couch all the time, but I just wanted to make sure, because something was just like smelling stink, when I about cameras, because I did have a problem with my, um, what do they call it, the, uh, 
the little thing where when you put food in the, the sink and the disposal I had a problem with the disposal early on and they came and fixed it so that wasn't you know the issue and then all of a sudden I kept doing like this and it'll get worse and I was like what is that <laughs> I was like, what is that stitch? Like, oh my goodness. So I had went upstairs to the bathroom and I had um I had looked in my breast <laughs> and then I was just like I lifted up and I and then it just like stuff like just it just all kept come pouring out like crazy. So I was just like whoa <laughs> and then I started seeing like the pulse and stuff and uh the 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 blood come out with it and I was just like freaking out like I was literally freaking out and I was just like you know what let me calm down let me fix myself up I didn't have any gauze so I just used band-aid um and then right now I just have it like openly and it's not a lot coming out it's just like a little bit right now so I just don't have a bra on nipples to the wind <laughs> so yeah but anyways you guys um that's what's going on uh, today so I'm just really I was had plans to go to like um, Dollar Tree and pick up some stuff like organization stuff and then I'm planning on a trip to go to Ikea um, and I was talking to my girl uh, Tiara in about how you know you go into uh, you go into Ikea how far Ikea is from Dallas it's like 45 minutes like away like you have to like clearly paint plate it out and then how you know, your kids just don't want to go in and, you know, stuff like that. So she gave me a really great, like, good, good advice on how, like, just take him to the little play area and let him play and stuff like that. He'll feel, you know, I guess he'll feel more better and he'll he'll be all right. <laughs> my son does not like going shopping with me. So, um, yeah. And my mom just gave me some coupons. Hey, she just gave me some coupons. So, mom on the budget here and then I got... Uh, Bed, Bath, and Beyond. They have some great storage items too as well. If you're looking to like, if you're decluttering your home and you just need like good storage items, they occasionally see you like 20% off on your um, in-store or online purchases. But I just love like just getting like different kinds of coupons in the mail and stuff like that. So um, yeah, if, you, if you're a single mom or a mom, or a mom that's married or boyfriend, bae, whatever, uh, by yourself, you can still save and be on a budget as well. And so I'm going to have some of my lemon water and I'm going to take some of my cranberry. These are like little cranberry um, pills, like tablets that I take every day now um, to just kind of wash my bajajay, you know, my girl, my, my best friend, watch her because, you know, after you have your period and stuff like that, you just need a good cleaning. She cleans naturally on her own, so I don't put, like, douche products and stuff like that. She cleans naturally on her own, but I uh, sometimes just go ahead and do the cranberry so I can just kind of pee everything out and help her along, push her, push her along. So I take those, and then I have my bottle of water here that I'm going to put my True Lemon packet in. Um, so yeah, let me do that. I'm gonna sit you guys down. Hope you guys stay there. Okay, so I'm just gonna put my true lemon packet in there real quick. <clears throat> but I hope you guys are doing really, really good and amazing today. Um, like I said, I'm just probably, I don't know if I'm gonna go anywhere today, but if not, I'll just stick around the house and try to, um, go through some stuff that I have in mom's house um, before I take it down to my house because mom has like bigger trash is where she are where she is and then we only have one trash where we stay at so yeah you guys know this is like my favorite water from Kroger's um, I won't drink any other water but that water but yeah anyways I'm gonna take my um, my tablets and then I'm gonna come right back so y'all better Sit still and while you at it, definitely don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit that thumbs up because definitely you guys are helping us um, on our channel and supporting your girl too as well. I had to turn the camera around because I think I was more dehydrated too as well. I think I was dehydrated. But I want to show you these amazing finds my mom found on the street. Like ain't nothing wrong with somebody throwing out their treasures and somebody else finding the treasure and fixing them up to the way they want it. Um, 
I just love this cup because mama ain't easy. Y'all know it ain't easy. It ain't easy. But you know what? We still make do. We still do what we got to do for our kids. Yes. So mama really ain't easy, but it's what you make of it, you know. So let me show you the stuff that mom found on the streets. She found this lovely um, cabinet thing with drawers in it. Got the little... Uh, drawers in it and everything was intact she didn't have to like look around but everything was like there you know um so yeah this is brand new let me tell you something though i just love the way the top portion looks i'm just hoping she gives it to me because i can really use it i can really use this at my house i could put my tv on it and use it um downstairs in the living room but i hope she hear me <clears throat> i hope she hears me but um yeah you guys i i like this and the way it looks and stuff like that um she uh said that she was getting it to my son to put his toys and stuff in to keep organ you know his toys his trains organized and stuff like that but how great is that how good is god my mom was just driving along and she saw it and actually yesterday we was out and i think it was coming back from uh, McDonald's for like I think breakfast time or whatever and um, I saw this cabinet thing I really wanted it but um, I was just I don't know I just I don't know why we didn't why I didn't tell mom to stop so we could get it but we've been finding some good things and um, this lady from that um, works at well she don't work at my job but she's a customer at my job and she told me she said you know when you find good stuff like uh, cabinets and stuff like that and stuff just good quality stuff on the streets or whatever she said that uh, mostly it's from people like um, I guess renting the homes and they already have like the stuff in the homes and some people just don't keep the stuff they actually just sit the stuff out so they could have just bought this from Walmart sit in the home for about a month and then put it on the street you know so I'm just really thankful that you know People are not like tr like doing crazy stuff with the products, um, especially like I don't have a, a issue with people think taking stuff to the Salvation Army. But my thing is that when you have good quality product like that, find a friend that wants it or put it out on the street because somebody is definitely definitely in need of some house stuff they might just had got a new apartment. You know, you just never know. But when you have stuff like this, good quality product and stuff like this um i definitely like i would just sit it out and let people get it because you never know who may need who may who may be in need you know um and mom also found this brunch table and she also i'm going to show you this brunch table i don't know if the lights didn't turn on or what okay yeah <clears throat> so mom found this nice wood brunch table it's so long and beautiful focus please my sister's stuff is on there, so well, let me grab it off so you guys can see. <clears throat> so yeah, mom found this nice brunch, long brunch table. I mean, what? Look what you can, you can do with it. Like I told mom, I said this would be so great. Like I can put my computer on here and go for what I know, but this will be super long desk, you know. But I think it's just meant to be a brunch table. Um, invite your family over, invite the neighbors over, you know, put the, put the table outside and just have a little, a little fun day or something. But this is nice, really nice. And nothing's broken on it. Everything is good. So yeah, I just, I really like it. Um, and then she also got this table right here too. Um, she been having this for a while, but she got this table, um, on the side of the street too, but the neighborhoods that my mom go and and find this stuff at it's like the the high the you know Deborah down the street she's high and mighty type of houses you know that type of place she goes to go find her stuff um and then as well mom found this table it's an ikea table she found this table on the side of the street as well um just right like I don't know where she found it. I think like right down the street. Maybe they were moving or something or they got put out or something like that. But they couldn't take it. So they left it out. Um, and then this product, this right here, I 
I was just like, this is just totally cool. Like, it's like supposed to be a wine rack. And she found this on the side of the street as well. She was not going to give this rack up. But you could tell, like I told her, this was something like a wine rack because it has like the little rack things where you can scoot your wine in. Or you can scoot, uh, put your wine glasses in right there. But mom made it. Mom had another thing right here where she had all her mason jars. I don't know if you guys remember, but I may take a snapshot of uh, that video where I had showed you she had made it out of a mason jar or another thing like that. But I love how she just came up with this idea. It looks so much so much more like space. She can put whatever she wants on it. So yeah, she has like all her seasonings and stuff, her beans, um, you know, oatmeal and stuff, flour. She had a lot of a lot of stuff. I'm gonna get mom some more um labels for her jars so that she can um, put more uh, more new up to date labels on there I haven't told her yet <laughs> but um, yeah I really like that it's really neat at first like I thought it was like one of those just ladder things and you can just like put your your uh, laptop on it and sit down but no that is a wine that is true that is a wine wreck I like I really like it so yeah mom she picked up some good stuff like seriously <laughs> Yeah, I'm not going to do much today. I think this is going to be the end of the vlog. I just want to kind of show you some of the stuff that mom picked up on the side of the street and how you can, you know, um, do the same thing. Just look around. Don't be shamed. Don't be shy because, I mean, they put the stuff out um, for you to get. So, um, yeah. And mom found something on the side of the street one day and the guy came out the house and he, he actually helped mom pick up the stuff and put it in her car you know so yeah and I was like I'm gonna start going with mom because I'm looking for a, a new bed frame and so if I can find one I'm gonna get it because um you know things are not getting any cheaper <laughs> things are not getting any cheaper you just grab what you can grab lights on up do your little sanitizing on the the product that you find on the side of the street wash it you know, and it's like brand new. Paint it if you have to. Um, but yeah. Um, but I'm out of breath. Because I ain't got no bra on. <laughs> um, but, see, but yeah. Um, I just want to come on here and just, you know, talk to you guys about what's going on in my life. And how I feel like, you know, you know, things are, are going to get better. I've been watching the news and. The stuff that I've been seeing on the news, like people getting shot, getting killed for no reason at all. Just especially in Dallas, there's been a lot of stuff going on. And I just, you know, I just I stop and pray. And, I, you know, especially I got a son, too. And it's, it's just getting, excuse my French, hella, hella like crazy around here. So um, that's why I don't speak to people. I don't, you know, unless they speak to me, I'll be nice and respectful and speak back. Um, but I'll try to hold conversation with people I don't know. Um, but yeah, you just have to be safe. You just have to get it and go. <laughs> That's how me and my mom model get it and go. Okay. Uh, so yeah, you just, you just have to stay praying, prayed up and praying for your kids while they are out doing their summer activities and stuff like that. You just have to stay prayed up and also pray for yourself as well. Um, I just pray for everybody. And with that being said, I love you guys. And yeah, I just want to share with you guys some of the stuff mom has found on the side of the street that I think is just like high, top hot quality stuff. And we like basically save coins. We didn't even have to go and buy any of this stuff, you know. So, um, yeah, but if we can do it, you can too as well. <laughs> so, yeah, you guys, make sure you give us a thumbs up and definitely subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching all the way. If you have made it to the end of our vlog today, thank you so much because that does also help us on our channel as well. So yeah, yeah, you guys, I love you. Bye.